Good morning, Patriots, and welcome to Rex Pines TV. I hope you all enjoyed your winter break and got everything you wished for. I'm Angie Walker. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Monday, January 3rd, 2022. Now let's take a rain break. Now, let's go to Scott for today's sports highlights. Thanks, Angeli. Sports fans, welcome back to Sports Equipment Origins. Today's edition is about the basketball. The very popular sport of basketball was invented by James Naismith in 1942. The original basketball was made of leather stitched together with a rubber material inside. As basketball made its way through history, it kept evolving and changing. Now, modern basketballs are more firm and made of inflatable inner rubber multiple layers of fiber and covered in hard leather. Guess the basketball made an impact that is far from small. Now let's go to Sonia for the lunch report. Thank you, Scott. Today's lunch is chili with cornbread, mixed vegetables, applesauce, and your choice of milk. Students, there is a shortage of sporks, so they can only be given to students that are purchasing lunch. Scholars, please make sure to let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit. Let's go back to Angeli. Thank you, Sonia. Scholars, here are the students that are able to attend the breakfast for passing 25 reading and 25 math iReady lessons. Fun scholars, patriots. The already assessments are soon. The first one is tomorrow, grades three through eight, ELA. Take a look at the flyer for more upcoming dates. Let's get those assessments done and try to study before the test. Now let's go to David for today's weather. Thank you, Angeli. Hey, patriots. Today's weather is. In other weather news. We're going to talk about black ice. You may think the ice is literally black, but it's not. Black ice can be extremely dangerous because it's a thin covering of ice mostly on concrete roads. Since it's clear and concrete roads are usually black, it looks like black ice. If you ever come across black ice while on the road, here's what you can do to stay safe. Our number one tip is to get your foot off the acceleration and brake lightly. If you do this, you should be okay. 
Now let's go to Destiny and Chanel for today's Hot Topic. Thank you, Angeli. Hey, Patriots. Welcome to Hot, hot topic, topic New Year's edition. edition. I'm Destiny. And I'm Chanel. And here's what's trending this week. New Year resolutions are currently being made or are being achieved. Most people reach for being more organized, losing weight, and exercising more. One of mine is catching more sleep. <laughs> The New Year's most iconic practice is the dropping of a monster ball in New York City's Times Square at the stroke of 12 p.m. People all around the world watched it on New Year's Day and continue to watch it over and over to look back at the wonderful time. It was definitely an amazing event. Now that it's a new year, people around the world have been doing traditions to kick off 2022, like throwing a party, eating 12 grapes at midnight, decorating a New Year tree, giving gifts, and much more. Hope everyone has good luck. There is one thing that we were looking to do or eat over the big break. The big feast. Food people ate for good luck were pork, black eyed peas, and grapes. I definitely enjoyed the meals. That's it, Patriots. Happy, Happy New, New Year's! Year's. And let's go to Valencia for the birthdays. Thank you, Chanel and Destiny. Today's birthday boys and girls are Kayla Estimable and Ethan Scarlett. Happy birthday! Now let's go back to Angeline. Thank you, Valencia. Scholars, here are your proud expectations. They are present. Present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Now, for last year's trivia winners, congrats to Ms. Samuel, Ms. Williams, Ms. Shadid, Ms. Stone, Ms. Cavalita, and Ms. Onley. You all had the correct answer to Friday's trivia question, which was, what is the largest organ on the human body? The correct answer is the skin. Teachers and scholars, here's today's trivia question. What country invented the ice cream sundae? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmo.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a marvelous Monday. And don't forget, this year we're all about fundamentals and forward focus. Have a great day!